In the 1800s, tambour beading was adopted by the French when it became a quick and efficient way to apply beads and sequins. However, the technique originates from India and is known as Ari, which means hook. Now there's a slight variation between the two techniques and the one that we're going to focus on today is the one that is used in the couture houses in Paris. However, we are going to have a look at Ari and combine one of those techniques into our final sample. So you can see the benefits of both of those techniques when they work together. Now the word tamba means drum in French, which is when the fabric is stretched across the warp and the weft to create a nice solid base ready for beading. Now another term used for tamba beading is Looneville. And Looneville is a very small, beautiful, uh, quaint town in France, which was the original home of tambo beading. And they became famous for their beautiful, exquisite beadwork and embroideries. So often it's referred to as the Looneville technique. <laughs> 